What's up guys, it's your boy KBDX Tokyo back again with another MetaZoo video. And if this is your first time stopping by, my name is KBDX Tokyo. I'm a TCG collector located in the Bronx, Bronx, New York, if you guys didn't know. And I started my YouTube journey not too long ago. And right now the goal is to reach a thousand subscribers. So if you guys like these types of videos, please do me a favor, hit that subscribe button and hopefully we can reach that goal. But in this video, I'm going to be opening a booster box of MetaZoo Wilderness. And if you guys have been keeping up with my MetaZoo content, you guys would know that this is the damaged box that I got in the master case that I bought not too long ago. So we're going to see how damaged the cards are inside of this box. And we're just going to have some fun opening some MetaZoo packs. Uh, before we get to this box, though, I also want to open a box that a subscriber sent me not only is he a subscriber he is a fellow metazoo content creator metazoo bokeh and i just want to say thank you my brother you've been nothing but positive and you've shown me nothing but love since day one and i just want to say i really appreciate that i am done with your package i will be shipping it off soon so i'll be hitting you up in a dm with the tracking number and everything but yeah so we're going to be opening this box before we get to the booster box um, and we're also going to be addressing some of the crazy MetaZoo rumors that have been going on. I just want to say this. Um, I think it's plain and clear to see that the closure letter that we got on Discord was a mistake. And the only reason why I say that, there's obviously clear signs that, you know, operations are still up and running. There's also the fact that they posted the letter and not too long after that they took down the letter and then all the accounts that were deactivated were then reactivated again so there's just a lot going on but it proves that metazoo is not dead it's not over operations are still up and running but the main proof of why i believe that metazoo is still up and running is the fact that metazoo cryptid clash is still going on i even believe that they're having a tournament soon and the whole cryptid clash is like the whole online version of the game the fact that that's still up and running is proof in itself that metazoo is still alive there's still people willing to play there's still fans out there that still want to play the game so just the fact that metazoo cryptic clash is still up and running makes me believe that you know things haven't totally ended yet for metazoo but the biggest rumor that's going on right now is the fact that bandai might be the company that purchases metazoo or has something to do with MetaZoo in the future. Now, this is just a rumor. Everything is just speculation at this point. But as of right now, all the artists left MetaZoo. Everyone that was affiliated with, Met with MetaZoo, like uh, Texas Ted, walked away. Right now, if, if a company decides to buy MetaZoo, they're buying MetaZoo at, at a clean slate. Yeah, they're also buying MetaZoo with the drama that it had in the past. But I believe they're also buying MetaZoo with the blueprints for the future. You know, I don't believe that they'll just drift off and do something totally new. Maybe um, they'll take the blueprints that they have so far and uh, they'll work with that and expand and do something more like totally. I, I don't want to go left. I don't want to go left with it. Um, there's just room for multiple possibilities to happen. But to think that MetaZoo is completely over and done with, I don't believe so. But one thing I do know is that this supposed closure letter that MetaZoo put out created massive controversy on social media on multiple platforms. I believe MetaZoo was trending like number two on like Twitter for like two days or a day or two, I, I don't know. But I know that MetaZoo was definitely trending hard. There's a lot, there's a lot going on with MetaZoo, but overall, do I believe personally that MetaZoo is dead? No, I don't believe MetaZoo is dead. And I am willing to stay with MetaZoo and enjoy the journey, no matter where the journey takes me. Whether MetaZoo succeeds or whether MetaZoo dies, I'm gonna be here along for the journey. And I believe just enjoying the journey is the most important part of being a collector. And uh, that's what I am. You know, I'm not an investor. I'm not a Timmy. I'm not someone that, that put thousands and thousands of dollars into MetaZoo. No, I'm just a casual collector that likes MetaZoo. 
and um, I, I, I'm willing to see it succeed. And I'm also here if MetaZoo does bad. So regardless, I'm going to open some MetaZoo packs for you guys. You're welcome to stick around and join me and obviously see some of the packs and the hollows that come inside of this booster box. If you're new to MetaZoo, of course. Um, but yeah, we're going to open some packs. But without further ado, let's just get straight into the video and let's open the box that MetaZoo Bouquet sent me. All right, guys. So I had to flip the camera around so you guys can get a better look at what we got going on here. So this is the box that Metazoo Bokeh sent me. And uh, yeah, let's just get straight into it and let's see exactly what's inside. Um, I'm kind of excited cause I'm not sure. I'm not sure what he sent me. Um, I just know that, you know, he hit me up in the DM and he explained that, you know, he likes the content and uh, to show support he wanted to send a little something, something my way. And uh, of course, you know, I appreciate the support. I appreciate the love. Thank you, my brother. So I'm gonna be sending that to you soon. Um, I'll hit you up with the tracking number and stuff like that. Um, so let's cut away from myself because last time we almost had an accident. Let me put this away. So yeah. All right, let's see what we got here. All right, let's see what we got. We got whatever he said, it was well wrapped. We got the, we got these little foam, foam thing. I don't know what you call these, but we got, we got some of those. Let's see what we got in here. Let's definitely well wrapped. Oh, all right, all right. So we got some blisters. He sent over some blisters, free gift, Metazoo bouquet. Yo, shout out to Metazoo. Yo, shout out to my brother, bro. For real, thank you, my brother. I really appreciate it. First edition Mothman pack, let's go. First edition Mothman pack, let's go. And then we also have this Christmas promo pack. I don't have that in my collection. These are two things that I don't have in my collection. I mean, I got a booster box first edition, but nothing loose. Like, I don't have no loose packs. Um, so we got some blisters here. We got, we got, yo, bro, you really hooking me up, brother. I appreciate you. I really appreciate you. So we got a native blister. Um, we got a hero, yo, bro, a hero quest blister. Yo, that's crazy. I definitely don't have that in my collection. I don't have a native blister. Um, and we got a Karomi single blister as well. Yo, thank you, brother. Thank you, brother. I really appreciate it. But there's more in here. We got more. He sent more. Let's see exactly what we got. All right, we got, it's looking like he sent us some, some singles. We got some singles, some sealed promos. Nice. We got some full hollows here. We got a Karomi promo. Yo, this Raven Mocker's fire. This Raven Mocker's fire, I'm not gonna lie. It's a native promo. So we got the Sentry Box Devil. I don't have these. I don't have these in my collection. Yo. We got a Karomi promo as well. Foo Fighters. Another, yo, these Karomi promos is fire. I'm not gonna lie. Um, and we have a Cryptid Nation first edition promo. What? You see that stamped? It's stamped. Oh, that's fire. That's fire. Yo, brother, brother, Metazoo Bokeh, yo, bro. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Thank you, bro, for real. Oh, wait, there's more in here? This. There's more. Free gift, KBDX Tokyo. Oh, that's fire. He's, wow. Yo, bro, I really appreciate that. So he sent me custom stickers so I can basically, you know, put these stickers on free gifts that I want to give away and, uh, you know, basically do what he does and uh you know 
put MetaZoo packs out in public and let random people try to find them. And uh, that's awesome. That's awesome. And it has my at. So whoever finds it will most likely, you know, look me up and try to, you know, subscribe. So it's, it's an awesome way of advertisement. Um, but yo, bro, I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. This, this right here, this means a lot. This means a lot. And I really appreciate it. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Um, let's see. We got more. We got more. Oh my God. He said, no, bro. He sent me a whole booster box. No, get out of here. Let's go, bro. I appreciate it, bro. Thank you. A second edition Cryptid Nation booster box. Definitely will be opening this. Matter of fact, you know what? I wish I wish he signed it. Cause if he signed it, it would it would definitely I would definitely keep this for my sealed collection. But you know, it's sentimental value to me. So I'm just gonna keep it sealed. You know, I'm I'm mostly a sealed collector. And um this is basically the first time that I was ever sent something from a subscriber and a fellow MetaZoo content creator. So it, it has more sentimental value to me than anything. Um, I really appreciate it, brother, for real, for real. I, I do, I'm gonna be sending you something nice as well. I hope you like it, um, but definitely, definitely, I really appreciate all the free gifts. But this right here, this right here is definitely, definitely something that it, it, it means a lot to me because this is gonna this is gonna be useful in uh, future content videos that I'm gonna be doing. So yeah, um, I appreciate you, brother. I'm gonna put all this to the side. Let's just double check and make sure that there's nothing else in here, cause you know. Just double check. We're just gonna double check. All right, guys. So we're gonna move on to the MetaZoo Wilderness Booster Box. Now this is my first time opening a MetaZoo Wilderness Booster Box. And it'll be cool, you know, for new people that's stopping by to see what the cards look like, see how the hollow pattern looks, uh, see see how the booster box looks. Um, but yeah, this right here is a booster box that was damaged. So I bought a master case of Wilderness Booster Boxes, and this was a box that had some damage. So I'm gonna open this right here and we're gonna see if any of the cards are damaged and we're gonna see if we pull anything good. So without further ado, let's just bust right into this. Um, I wanna give a special thank you to MetaZoo Bokeh. I really appreciate all the free stuff that you that you sent me, bro. Like for real, it means, it means a lot. Um, so yeah, this is my first booster box of Wilderness. Definitely my first booster box of wilderness. I'm excited. Um, the booster box is definitely, definitely beat up. As you guys can see, we got some creases. We got some creases and damage here. So it's definitely, definitely beat up. Um, but let's see. Oh, I like that. I like the fact that there's a void sticker there and you can see that it's like a little hollow pattern. So it's, it's basically tampered proof. Basically, that's why it's there. Um, so yeah, let's uh, fix this. My first MetaZoo booster box. Awesome. So let's take out the packs. Let's see if the packs are looking crazy. See if any of the packs are looking crazy in here. All right, so not that bad. As you can see, not that bad. Um, but that's the good side. That was the good side. So let's uh, let's see the bad side. Let's see what the bad side is looking like. All right. All right. So the bad side is looking all right. The cards feel good. I don't. It doesn't feel like any of them are bent. So I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Let's see. It's looking like it's good so far. I don't think any of the cards are you know too too damaged. Hopefully. Um. But yeah, man. I'm excited. I'm definitely excited. If this is your first time stopping by, I uh, just want to say thank you. So I'm basically new to this as well. You know, these are, this is my first time 
busting open a MetaZoo Wilderness Booster Box. So we got the Anti Potion Potion. We got this guy, rest in peace. So we're gonna go slow at first, and then um, we're just gonna slide through, um, just so you guys can get a clear view of all the cards. I don't know if you got right there. I had to focus it for you guys because it was getting crazy. Um, but yeah, man, I'm kind of excited for the future of MetaZoo. So we got a reverse hollow golden bear. There's a lot of a lot of controversy going on. Oh, that's cool. That's cool as well. So we're gonna keep that and put these to the side. All right. <clears throat> Let's move on to the next pack. But yeah, man, there's a lot of controversy going on surrounding MetaZoo. And um, a lot of people are upset. There's a lot of people upset, but I'm not upset, man. Definitely not upset. I'm, I'm, I'm willing to take the journey and see where MetaZoo ends up. But, oh yeah, this, this card is fire. Night, Night Marchers. Night Marchers. Nah, this, this card is fire. This card is fire. Oh, we got a full hollow black dog. It's our first full hollow. Gonna put that to the side. So we're moving on. What is this, the third pack? I think we're just gonna start flying through this, but I'm not gonna lie, man. People say that they don't like the artwork. I think the artwork looks pretty wavy. And wavy is uh, basically a slang term uh, that we use in New York. It might be a little outdated, but I still use it. You know, I still use it. But yeah, wavy is like a, a slang term for cool, I guess. Um, if you're from New York, you know. You know the vibes. You already know the vibes. If you're not from New York, then you know. And I guess you know now. But yeah, man. I'm not gonna lie, man. People people really be hating on MetaZoo. And a lot of these cards, a lot of these cards are really nice, man. Oh, we got a nice golden haired girl. Now I'm not even sure what the hit cards are in this set. But these hollows, these hollows look amazing. I am not gonna lie. So we got another full hollow. So as of right now, we got uh, two full hollows and two reverse hollows. So, you know, it's looking pretty even. It's looking pretty even. But for, I don't know, man. I'm really excited to see the future of MetaZoo and what's in store, you know? If, if the rumors are true and Bandai is definitely taking over, I think I think that's exactly what MetaZoo needs, you know? I think, you know, there's a lot of people hating on MetaZoo and these people want to see MetaZoo fail. And, you know, some, some, some have, you know, their rights to want, to want that to happen, you know? Some, some people got really, some people got burnt really burnt and um i guess you know i guess there's no coming back from that for them but for people like me that are just casual collectors uh, for new people awesome this is awesome these i don't know man these hollows and these cars they, they look they look wavy man they look nice but um but yeah, let's move on to the next pack. I don't know. I'm just rambling on here, man. I'm just rambling. I'm just rambling. I'm just rambling. This is basically my first time opening a booster box of uh, some wilderness. So, you know, I'm still new, still pretty new to, to MetaZoo. So, you know, I don't know all the chase cards. I'd admit that I'm still a noob. I'm still a noob. And I'm not I'm not scared to, to admit that, you know. People people be under my comments and 
they be talking to me as if I'm I'm an investor. Like I got thousands invested into this. Like no, bro, I'm I'm a casual collector. I like MetaZoo for what it is. You know, even if MetaZoo was to confirm that it's over, you know, I'd still I'd still collect it. I'd still open up packs because look at this. Just look at this. Just look at this. Poncho had some of the best artwork. I'm not gonna lie. Like, look at this. This looks so fire. We got another reverse, reverse hollow. So we stacking up on the reverse hollow so far. Ooh, that dark aura. I really want this dark aura in a full hollow. It would be amazing. Definitely would be amazing. Definitely would be amazing. But let's move on, let's move on. I like the packaging too. I think the packaging for MetaZoo is phenomenal. Phenomenal. All right, we got John Henry. Got Shatter Ice. Come on, man. Woo! Iowa Dragon Reverse Halanito. So I think, isn't Iowa Dragon one of the chase cards or some shit like that? I think Iowa Dragon is a chase card. I'm not sure. I'm not totally sure. I am a noob. Please. Don't kill me in the comments. Please, don't kill me in the comments. But, you know, I think more people should just, you know, open MetaZoo for the fun of it. Definitely just open MetaZoo for the fun of it. It's definitely affordable. Definitely affordable. So, why not? Why not? You know? Even if people hate it. Even if people want to see it fail. I'm just going to open it because, you know, showing new people that wants to, you know... We just got to do it for the new people that stop by, you know? I like the fact that the MetaZoo community sticks together. They support one another. And, um, you know, if we're going to make content, the content is most likely going to be for the new people that wants to stop by and check out MetaZoo, you know? Obviously, we're going to have the people that hate MetaZoo and are going to be on top of our necks and telling us, you know, why, why are you even open this Meta poo. Don't open it. Woo! This free frozen spirit sig with what the fuck? What the fuck is this? I don't know what what that what is this, but is this what? Hey yo. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but it looks nice. It looks nice. So we got a full hollow here. Let's put that to the side. It looks nice. These I don't know, man. I don't know why people be hating on these cars, but they look nice. They be hating, and they look beautiful. Um, I do want to open a Nightfall booster box because I think out of all the sets of MetaZoo so far, I think Nightfall would be my favorite of them all because um, I like more of the the dark the dark side of MetaZoo and, and that seems like more of the darkest the darker side of MetaZoo um but yeah we got the full hollow I think we had this in a reverse hollow and now we got it in a full hollow so pretty cool pretty cool hateful demise definitely want that in a full hollow if they have it um But yeah, man, let me know if you guys want me to bust open some more MetaZoo packs for you guys. Um, I don't know, man. I don't know. Woo, we got some peanuts. These nuts. We got some peanuts here. Reverse hollow. Reverse hollow. So yeah, man, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen in the future of MetaZoo. But no matter what. I'm here for the long run. Another reverse hollow. We doubled up on that one. Definitely doubled up on that one. So I'm not sure what the pull rates should be for a booster box um, as far as the full hollows. I think maybe it should be around 12 or 13 full hollows per booster box or somewhere around that. Somewhere around that. Oh, we got lizard people reverse hollow. That's nice. I want that in a full hollow. Um, yeah, 
So we're going to speed it up a little bit here. Definitely going to speed it up. I don't want to be wasting all you guys' time. Um, but I know you guys want to see the pull rates for the hollows and the reverse hollows. Token sitter. Okay. That looks nice. Not bad. So we it's like we're getting a lot. We're getting a lot of reverse hollows in this in this booster box. Um, but as far as the cards, for it being a damaged booster box, cards don't seem damaged at all. Cards are actually in very good condition. So Big Bird. We got a Big Bird Reverse Hollow. So for the box being all crumbled up like it is, I think the cards are A1. They're pretty good. They're not damaged. They're not damaged. Corners look good. Everything looks... There's no whitening. I'm, man, these... these uh, oh, wait. There's whitening on this. What is that? What is that? See the corner on that? I'm not sure if you guys see the corner on that, but it got a little whitening on it. So I guess I stand corrected. Um, Kindling Spark Root. Kindling Spark Root. Full hollow. I don't know, man. These hollows look amazing. They look super, super nice. And the fact that, you know, each set has its own special hollow pattern, I mean, the detail, the detail. It's the little detail like that that makes the TCG stand out. That's what I believe. But yeah, man, I'm just a casual MetaZoo collector, man. I'm just, I'm not trying to get rich off of MetaZoo. We got another full light. We got a starlight, seagull, whatever it is. I don't know how to say it. But yeah, nice, full hollow. I guess we're racking up on some full hollows. Not sure, like I said, not sure um, exactly what the chase cards are. I think this is a chase card. Obviously, um, Bigfoot is a chase card. Um, I believe, what is this? The Iowa Dragon? This is not Iowa Dragon. This is one of them. I don't know, I forgot the name of this one. I'm still a noob. I'm still a noob. Don't don't kill me. Don't kill me, man. I'm still a noob to all this. And I think that's the best part of it, you know, because I'm I'm also new to MetaZoo. So I'm seeing a lot of these cards and I'm opening a lot of these cards for the first time. You know. And hopefully, if you're new to my channel and you're new to this video, we're sharing the same experience. Um, we're opening packs that we never seen before. I've never seen or opened these packs before. Um, I mean, I have seen people open these packs, but as far as me opening them personally, this is this is my first big opening. You know, reverse hollow. <sighs> we need we need some more we need some more hollows. I want the Bigfoot. We got to at least pull a Bigfoot. Don't tell me we're going to get a whole booster box of Wilderness and not pull a full hollow Bigfoot. We got to at least pull the reverse hollow. But we need a Bigfoot. At least. Like, at least. Don't tell me I'm going to go through a whole booster box and not pull a Bigfoot. But I guess that's good, right? Because the, the, um, the Bigfoot is not, you know. Oh! Iowa Dragon for Hollow, baby. I think this is a chase card. This got to be a chase card. Iowa Dragon for Hollow. Let's go. So that's that's a good that's a good card, I believe. That's a good card. Let me know in the comments down below. You guys will let me know. Flame my boots. Flame my boots. You, I give all y'all passes to flame my boots because you know I'm 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 still a noob. So. I don't know much. So you're welcome to make fun of me. Definitely. Definitely welcome to make fun of me. Um, but I do appreciate everyone that stops by and, uh, you know, show support to the channel. Whether it be you leave a like, whether you leave a comment, or if you hit that subscribe button, it means a lot to me. 
definitely means a lot to me. You know, I've been working a little hard on my content creation journey. You know, it's been a, it's been a little while, and uh, I, it's been going good. I've been enjoying the journey so far. I've been enjoying it. Um, I love the community. I love being a part of the community. Um, like even today, like today, I legit spoke with gary pokemon like gary king pokemon like i legit was exchanging comments with him and he actually followed me on instagram so i i just you know you manifest your dream and definitely this is a dream of mine wow we got germinate germinate we got germ i said germinate <laughs> we got germinate in a full hollow but as i was saying you can definitely you know manifest your dreams and being a successful YouTuber is definitely, definitely one of my dreams. And um, as of right now, I'm doing all this for fun, you know? I buy cards out of my own pocket, out of my own pocket, you know, from my own expenses, you know, just to have fun with you guys. Uh, but yeah, we got this atmospheric jellyfish, which the card looks really nice, I'm not gonna lie. I like that. I would definitely love this in a full hollow. Um, but yeah, man, the full hollows in this booster box are pretty scarce. Pretty scarce. But I'm I'm happy we pulled the Iowa Dragon. I'm pretty sure that has to be a chase card. That has to be. Um, we got Big Bird in a full hollow. I believe we got this as um a reverse hollow as well. Got that as a reverse hollow as well. So we got a couple more packs left. Not too much. If you guys enjoyed the video and you've been sticking with us this far, please hit that subscribe button for your boy. It'll really mean a lot. Um, if you're part of the MetaZoo community and you're still here watching the video, I really appreciate you guys. Much love to the MetaZoo community. Um, I think the best thing that I like as, as a new person joining MetaZoo, you know, I started collecting MetaZoo like what, 10 months ago. So as a new collector stepping into MetaZoo, the, the one thing I like the most is the fact that the community has each other, has each other's back. Like, you know, they, they really look out for one another and i really like that the most hateful demise this is one that i said i said i wanted this in a full hollow and look look we got it we got it and this card is sexy sexy oh my god so i don't know i don't know if you guys notice but like a full hollow the card is, it's like the whole card is textured different from a regular, from a regular card. Like this card, you can definitely tell there's a clear difference in the card quality from a, a hollow to a regular card. I don't know. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that or, you know, but I, I kind of like that quality on the hollow. You can tell it's definitely good quality. Um, as a matter of fact, all these cards, all these cards feel pretty premium. They don't feel cheap. You know, most people will get into MetaZoo and they'll think like, oh, it's a new game. You know, these cards must be, they must look cheap. They must feel cheap. Actually, no, you'd be, you'd be surprised. Uh, these, these cards actually feel pretty good. They, pr they feel pretty good. Um, we got a reverse hollow there, and we could throw all that to the side. But you got a lot of bulk. I got a lot of bulk here. But I also have a TCG vending machine, and um, that's where a lot of these bulk cards and hollows and reverse hollows will be going. They'll be going straight into my vending machine. Um, I will be doing a follow-up video this spring. Um, this spring, I will be bringing out my my vending machine, and uh, I'll show you guys an in-depth look of my vending machine. It's really nice. We got a reverse hollow here. Let's put that to the side. 
and let's move on. But yeah, a lot of you are probably surprised. Like, oh my God, you got a vending machine? Yes, it's really nice. Like, really, really nice. Really nice. Um, I think I actually have um, a YouTube shorts or a YouTube video um, showing you guys a little clip of... Wow, we got the Hunted Tundra. Hunted Tundra. All right, nice. Uh, but yeah, I think there's a video on my page, on my YouTube page, um, basically showing you guys a little in-depth look of my vending machine. So if you guys want to go check that out, definitely more than welcome. Definitely more than welcome. Um, so we're almost done here with the packs. Definitely almost done. Snipe. Got a snipe. Guy looks weird. Put that to the side. But I don't think we're pulling a, a, a Bigfoot, man. If Bigfoot is hard to pull like this, I think, you know, it's pretty valuable. He should be valuable. He should be valuable. If he, if you can't pull him in a whole booster box, definitely has to be a valuable chase card. We got Curse. Come on, man. Come on. Oh, wow. That was bad. That was bad. Put that to the side. We didn't get nothing. We didn't get nothing. I don't know, man. Is this a harsh booster box? Is this a harsh booster box? We're gonna. I'm going to be opening another Metazoo uh, booster box. Um, Obviously, I got a whole master case, so I'm definitely going to be opening a lot of wilderness. But yeah, man. Last pack, we got a full hollow black dog. That's not bad for the last pack, I guess. We got last pack. Last pack magic. With a full hollow. And um, I guess we got we got a little bendage there. There's a little there's a little bendage there. Not too bad, you know. You could put this in a hard sleeve and uh it'll probably, you know, warp back into place. But let's see how many full hollows we got here. All right, so these are all the hollows right here. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So yeah, like I said, we get like I think it's twelve or thirteen hollows per booster box, but uh, we didn't get we didn't get the uh, the Bigfoot. Definitely didn't get the Bigfoot, but we did get an Iowa Dragon. I'm not sure if this is a chase card. You guys let me know in the comments below. Um, shout out to Metazoo Bokeh. Thank you, my brother. I really appreciate the gift. If you guys like these types of videos, please hit that subscribe button. It's your boy, KBDX Tokyo. Stay tuned for the next video.